In 2015, Tim Young and Scott Drummond opened a new contemporary style of fast food restaurant in San Francisco called Eatsa. It's a new concept of dining that takes away the waiters and the cashiers and replaces them with technology. Today, there are six locations across the US and plans to keep expanding. Eatsa is a quick service restaurant serving a growing menu of quinoa based meals, as well as snacks and drinks. Customers order either on their mobile phones or on tablets in the store itself. The ordering process is extremely customizable. Customers can choose from a selection of pre-put together meals or create their own. Once they have ordered, behind the scenes their meal is prepared and delivered to a cubbyhole. The customer is alerted on their mobile phone or on the screens in the store and their names displayed on the glass. Customers collect their food without any human interaction. Eatsa aims to deliver healthy, nourishing meals quicker and at a lower cost by incorporating technology into its operation. The concept of self-service is infiltrating our lives through progressions in supermarket checkouts, online shopping and of course dining. It's an attractive marketing concept and benefits companies and consumers. Generally, self-service saves a company on labour costs and saves customers in time and product costs as well as delivering a new and innovative purchasing experience. For a concept to be considered innovative, it must be perceived by consumers as new and different. It needs to satisfy a specific customer need and to do so cost effectively, as well as use a method that has not been seen before. Eatsa is classified as a dynamically continuous innovation. Using intentional variations on an existing service it requires its customers to change their behaviours in order to use it and to reap the benefits. What makes Eatsa so innovative is its level of customization and relationship with technology. Customers are able to customise their meals and orders, have their smartphones remember their preferences, suggest new ingredients for Eatsa to add to their range, and save money on discounts for repeat visits. Eatsa uses technology to build a relationship with its customers. With the lack of human interaction, they are still able to build a connection with people. The ordering stations will ask questions like, what do you feel like today? Are you vegan, lactose intolerant, gluten free? Do you want the same as last time? In today's age of food intolerances and a plethora of dietary preferences, this level of personalization and individual attention is extremely appealing aspect for Eatsa customers. Eatsa has recognized trends in the marketplace, being technology incorporation and food personalization and a design and experience that focuses on these trends. Eatsa first opened its doors in the eyes of consumers in August 2015, San Francisco. Closely followed was New York City and Washington stores, all offering a variety of demographic, psychographic and behavioural aspects of the market. Potential customers from such a wide base have assisted in attracting consumers from unlikely segments who may not usually purchase such products. Due to the innovation and change in environment ESA has created, the late majority in laggards are out of the question in terms of target marketing as they resist and cannot adjust the variation. Product adoption of the new ideas and concepts are attractive to the target markets innovators, early adopters, and the early majority. Targeting the 16% of innovators and early adopters is crucial as they are opinion leaders and social influencers. Once opinion leaders start using the products, a trend occurs and a further 34% of the early majority are then influenced to purchase, creating a market coverage of around 50%. ESA's dynamically continuous innovation target market lies within the early adopters as their willingness to purchase and try new ideas is high and a large social influences. ESA's positioning strategy has analysed the change in consumers' attitudes, values and beliefs. Consumers' demands for affordable, fast, healthy meals is exactly what ESA has offered and developing their marketing mix exclusively around this. They have created an innovation technique of allowing consumers to modify their own needs through meal customization and ensure all other aspects of the environment are stable. Product positioning in the consumer's mind is crucial and although Eatsa may not be the highest, it will be positioned as a healthy alternative 
and it's allowed the customization of their meals to reposition their product automatically in the consumer's mind. There are many influences that affect a consumer's decision. A main influence for ESA to consider is situational influences like physical environment and time. Because of their limited change across the country, the geographical location may reduce their position for many consumers who are not close by to one of their six stores. Through Eats' strong use of technology and social media, it can be understood they are demographically targeting younger generation. It is also clear they are targeting consumers of a certain lifestyle or health and fitness. Geographically, they are now constrained to their locations in America. Using geodemography, Eats are able to make a decision on where to open their stores by defining locations or suburbs where consumers share a lifestyle that aligns with their target market. In creating a brand, Easter has analysed the competition's position in the marketplace and found a creative advantage to set themselves apart, differentiating themselves from fast food outlets with the healthiest standpoint in humanist stores. Once the advantage had been established, Eats then built their brand personality around that. Their identity is largely linked to health, quality and technology. They have achieved this through a number of marketing strategies. Their simple red logo contains a radiating bowl of quinoa, ensuring their brand is known for simple, nourishing food. Their creators have been public figures through the opening and growth of Eatsa, doing interviews and sharing their insights and aims. This is rare for a fast food restaurant, but follows the usual public relations strategy of technical companies like Apple or Telstra, where their creators are the spokespeople. This positions their brand as modern and innovative. Easter has created an environment that meets the social and cultural needs of consumers through their innovative approach. The marketing environment involves internal and external forces that affect the business's ability to build and maintain successful relationships with customers. Also known as opportunities and threats, external factors play a huge role in the food service industry, especially in fast food. America's competitive environment is huge and the question of developing a distinctive competency has been answered with Easter's various advantages. Fast food choices are beginning to transition into healthy alternatives as media begin to objectify traditional fast food due to the rise in obesity and health related disease. Mass marketed fast food chains such as McDonald's, Chicken Fill and Burger King are becoming less sought after and are bringing out new product lines to compete with the likes of Easter. Better, faster food is a perfect value proposition, reflecting their business ideology, differential benefit, and also reflects a rapid change in the fast food industry. Food service technology is the true differential benefit for consumers of Eatsa as food is pre-ordered and prepared on pickup, or ordered in store on an iPad and created within minutes. Food is consumer specific as they can create their own or choose from a prepared menu. Easter also allows consumers to review their meals and make menu changes on their interests. The market is monopolistic, so developing unique benefits is the link towards attracting customers. A recent report on fast food spending showed that the average American will spend upwards of $12.50 in one fast food outing, with the average price of a meal being $4 to $7. Easter's specialised quinoa bowls are offered at $6.95, meaning not only do they fit into the average price bracket, but as well under the average spent by Americans. East has entered the market and begun promotion at a time where fast food's futures are converting into cheap, nutritional meals. All the boxes are being ticked by Easter with Mark Bittman from the New York Times making a point that American standards for fast quality fast food is rising, as are diet friendly meals. Vegetarian, vegan and gluten free options enables Easter to target consumers from all ethnicities and cultural backgrounds. The FDA's recent contribution also enforces enforced legislation that states nutritional information must be displayed on all fast food. And due to Easter's exceptionally nutritious menu, this acts as a competitive advantage over traditional fast food chains. Although Easter has taken a leap forward in technological advancement, there is the threat of competing businesses taking similar approaches and also consumers resisting the way they see fast food. Easter has improved the life cycle of their products in comparison to competitive. Once the food chain has gained attention through the public eye and begins the growth phase, it ensures the maturity phase is extended by giving consumers endless milk creation, a specialty app full of rewards, instant services, and by far one of the easiest food services available. This ensures that the sales decline will never truly occur until competition improves. Food chain's role in society is to provide items of consumption as previously spoken about the quality varies. 
Exceptionally fast food is the augmented service provided by Eatsa and sets them apart from competitors. Due to the elimination of customer service, the variable of unreliability is gone and an increase in the consistency of marketing responsiveness is made. Eatsa's innovative ideology has taken the healthy eating approach and improved fast food to create products valuable to consumers.